morning how you guys doing oh my god I'm crying all right today I got a little bit of a different video for you some of you know this but some of you may not I don't know there's a lot of you lots of subscribers here we're doing big things but I actually design album art for artists like rappers and singers and to make these covers I usually use Photoshop um, and I think a lot more people should start to learn Photoshop because it's a very valuable skill and Photoshop is just fun so sometimes I hear this like really good song and then I see the cover art and it's just like makes me sad. I think the importance of cover art is stifled in today's society is what I'm trying to say. So if that's the right way to say it, I don't know. So the first cover that makes me um, upset is Care Package by Drake. These were all like, like I'm an OG Drake fan, so these were all like good songs to me. I heard them like they all leaked before on, on SoundCloud or somewhere else. It's not like they were new songs, but um, they were some of the hidden gems and they were like, Getting emotional. <laughs> they were some of my favorite songs. They still are, but not so much now that everyone knows about them. It was cool that not a lot of people knew about them. But whatever, he dropped them in a in a little album called Care Package, and the album art honestly is complete shit, which upsets me. His other album art's great. Take Care, classic. Uh, the one where he's sitting on the towers isn't that great because I don't know. It just looks kind of weird. Maybe we'll fix that one some other day. It really kind of looks like he used some sort of um, photo editing app on his phone. Maybe. Basically, if I had to rate it out of ten, I would probably give it um, cap. Why do people say that? What does that mean? He put like a car. It's like a, it's like a blurry picture of a car with some weird uh, some weird font. I don't know. This guy. Drake, come on, man. If you need art, just I'm one phone call away, but don't be doing this, all right? Let's keep the uh, original theme of this cover art going. I think he wants it dark, so I'm gonna make the background black. I'm gonna go real simple with it. I found this picture of a crate on the internet. It kinda looks like a care package. And I think we got something. We gotta start. This, this looks pretty cool here, Drake. I think I'll put Hair package. I don't know. This font is fine for this. Boom. Why would a why would a care package say care package on it? Life's full of mysteries. Let's just make it look real for a sec. Add a little bevel. Oh, not like that though. Okay, now we're talking. Looks a little bit 3D. Looks a little more integrated. Still looks a little bit stupid. Is that how you spell package? Yeah. Get the little owl in here on the top. Boom, boom. Oh, uh, I think that looks pretty good. Just uh, found this little sticker. I'm gonna stretch that boy. This might be a little corny. We'll find out. Never, never use this font. Please, never use it. I'm gonna use a blending mode to make it look like it's really on that. It's not perfect. Life isn't perfect. Just stuck, someone just threw that on there. They didn't give a shit. That looks kind of cool so far. I don't know if, um, I'd say we at least got from a, from a five to a six. And you always, always put your parental advisory sticker to really give it that album art feel. It looks good now, but it always looks better after you compose it at the end and you take it into what I like to call camera raw filter because that's what it's called this is where the actual magic happens because you can get any look you so desire always boost the grain you know you need grain if you zoom in you can see what i mean grain is just adding all those little freaking it's just making it look like how do you even explain it you get what i mean and boom oh god that's very grainy i may have overdone it i always add like this little speckle I guess it's more grain, but it's just kind of making it look like worse than it really is. But turn that way down. Okay, Drake. I mean, I don't know. You guys tell me in the comments. Is that better or worse? I think it's better, but I'm a little biased. Drake, I know you're watching this. Don't be downloading photo editing apps. Just know I can do it. I can do it better. <laughs> Let's do another. 
7 EP Lil Nas X. I know you're probably uh, watching this with Drake right now, just chilling. But your album cover needs some work, my guy. Props to the artist. I think it's I think it's painted. It's dope, but I'm gonna make a better one. Please don't cry. I'm just gonna basically try to remake what he has here, except not in a painted style. I want to do it in a in a. I don't even know. Let's just see what happens. Some sort of mountainy overlook is what I searched. Okay. We got it. We're just gonna stretch it so it fits. Put it like so, like so. All right, first of all, it's gotta be nighttime. This is gonna be hard. We're gonna have to do a day to night transformation in Photoshop, which is possible. Just get rid of those clouds, why not? Gonna mess with the levels, darken it a lot. I'm gonna take these stars now. That looks pretty nightly, and it's all gonna come together in the end, so you never gotta really worry. All right, we put a moon in there. Wow, that is a beautiful moon for my beautiful boy, Lil Nas X. Why is it cut off at the top? No problem, we'll fix it. There we go. All right, moon's glow, moon's glow, and that's just a fact. Oh shit. I do glow by duplicating, changing the blending mode to lighten, and then blurring it. These are industry secrets here. Okay, he had like a, a city, some sort of futuristic city. <laughs> oh, sci-fi, that's a good word for it. I might take some of this, 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 really anything you can find. Watch this, you don't even have to be that, that nice with it. Boom, it's gonna be coming through the fog down here, I think. I want it to be like a big city, so I'm gonna put this down. I'm gonna duplicate it, put it over here, maybe flip it so it's the other way, you can't really tell. It looks terrible, I know, it looks terrible, I know. Bear with me. Boom, some more buildings in there. Going to try to blend it into the fog, and that is the goal. I'm just painting some fog because that's the best way to do it. I think that's pretty well integrated. We got the basics. That one's cool, dude. That is not, isn't that? I think that's from Red Dead Redemption. So this is, I gotta mask this out. All right, let's see what we got here. That's pretty, pretty close. That's pretty good, pretty good. But this is like, like that doesn't look real. He would be back lit in this situation because the moon's right there. Basically he'd be like a silhouette, like he'd be dark. So once you start to darken him, you already see what I mean. I'm just gonna go around the edges and add some edge lighting. And we got the base, baby. We got the base. That took a long time. Parental advisory. Don't want your children listening to this. And then you know where the magic happens. Camera raw filter. Ha. Mess with the colors now. It's the best part. Boom. That's pretty good. That one was pretty good. I like it. I definitely like it better than the original. But some people may not. That's just how the cookie crumbles. Little Nas X. You and Drake really need to hit me up. Just saying. I think I made this one better. But you let me know in the comments. Please. All right, that was freaking fun. But for real, thank you so much for watching. I like making videos like these. So if you like this and you want to see more, you got to let me know. And if there's any album covers that you want to see me fix, then put them in the comments. Don't forget to like this video. And if you're new, please consider subscribing because that'd be pretty cool. I'll see you later.